So just coming to sit, really sensing the body, so really sensing into the body, just feeling the body being held by the chair, feet on the floor, real sense of the body is just being held, held by the ground, by gravity, a real sense of safeness, and awareness of the breath. So we just come to settle here. And then just bring your attention, particularly to the breath. Maybe just lengthening the in and out breath slightly to about the same length as each other. That just feels right for you. And possibly counting to three or four on the in breath. Three or four on the out breath. Or same breathing in, breathing out. We're just allowing our minds to settle. We're giving them something to focus on. The regulation of the breath, the counting of the words. And maybe the thoughts just start slowing slightly or gaps between thoughts. We're not trying to push them away. We're not trying to get rid of thoughts. We're just letting them settle. Maybe if they appear to become faster or more, that's okay, that's just how it is. Just allowing whatever happens to happen. Just lengthen the in and the out breath, just a little. Counting to three or four on the in breath, three or four on the out breath. Or saying breathing in, breathing out. That doesn't work for you. Just bring your awareness to the breath or the body if that doesn't work either. And if the mind wanders, just really gently, very kindly, bring the intention back to the breath. And each time the mind wanders, just acknowledging it and coming back to the breath. And then just bring your attention particularly to the out breath. And maybe noticing each time you breathe out, where there might be just a sense of relaxation in the body. sense maybe the awareness dropping into the body. As the mind's held by the body, the body by the ground. So then just letting go, the regulation of the breath, the counting of the words, and just bring your attention to the body. And just gently and gradually taking your attention down to your toes, sole of your feet, just noticing the, their contact with the ground. And gently bring your awareness up the legs, lower legs and the knees and the thighs. Just noticing all the sensations there, just being curious, not wanting to change it. Just noticing how it is in this moment in time. Your hips and your pelvis, lower back and the middle back and the upper back, the belly and the chest, maybe noticing the movements with the breath. It's been curious because the first time you experienced your body, I mean, what others there is, it's right, it's how it is at this moment in time. Fingertips, palm the back of the hands and the wrists, the lower arms, 
elbows and upper arms, shoulders, the neck, the face and the scalp. And then just extending that attention out to the whole body. So just being aware of the whole body as it is at this moment in time. Noticing sensations as they come and go. There's the body. And then just very gradually, very gently, taking awareness back down the body. Again, being really aware of the body on the chair, the feet on the floor. How the body's supported. Your sense of being grounded. In being grounded, that sense of being safe, held. Maybe a sense of contentment. This moment in time, it's nothing you need. You've got everything you need. Just here at this moment. And then just bringing your awareness to what's going on to the sensations in the body at this moment in time. What thoughts are there? What emotions? Again, you're not wanting to change it. Just being curious, how am I at this very moment in time? What's going on? And then, either visualising, imagining, sensing, whatever works for you, a vast space around you. And in that space, in the middle of that space, there's a door or gateway that's open and opens outwards, away from you. And then each time you breathe out, just breathing out any thoughts, Sensations, emotions, be they positive or negative or neutral, just breathing them out with each breath. And as you breathe them out, they transform to a golden light of compassion. Each out breath, a golden light filled with compassion, as you might visualize or maybe just sense. And the golden light just passes through that door. And as it passes through the door, it goes out to all beings. Each time you breathe out, breathing out a golden light of compassion, passing through the door and passing to all beings. A golden light of compassion. Just being there to meet people's needs. to resolve their issues. Breathing out, breathing out that golden night of compassion, that breath full of whatever's going on within you. So you're not holding on to thoughts or emotions or sensations. You're just breathing them out with the breath. And just letting them go freely. As they turn into that golden night, Golden night is full of compassion. And each time you breathe out, that space is becoming full and full of that golden light. The space is just filling up with golden light. Real sense of compassion. Sending out that golden light of compassion with each breath, whatever it might be. It might be negative emotions, it might be difficult thoughts. It just gets changed into that light of compassion. Knowing that compassion truly arises from our own suffering. To be truly compassionate, we have to know what suffering is. 
and breathing out that sense of all your thoughts and sensations, emotions, as it becomes a golden light and the space fills up. But um, not only is that golden light going out to all beings, but also it comes back to you so you can absorb that golden light of compassion. Really sensing into that feeling of compassion. Really sending out that sense of relief of suffering for all beings, including ourselves. Letting that golden light come back to us as well as to other people. Absorb the golden light and we breathe out our thoughts, sensations, emotions, turn them into golden light, passing to others and ourselves. And then just letting go of any visualization, any sense of that golden light in the door, just coming back to your breath and to your body. Noticing how your body feels at this moment in time. If there's any sense of compassion within the body, and where that's held. Or well, there might be areas of difficulty, knowing that's okay too. Just being curious. <laughs> 